Hey y'all, three view here, but again, two view. I'm Matt. I'm Tyrell. And we did Cowboys and Aliens this time. Uh, pretty good movie, so not too many bashings this time. Not really. A few inconsistencies, but you know, that that's Hollywood. That's but, uh, are. you want to start off? Well, I was pretty mad that they didn't show the chick naked because she's like, she's hot. Oh, Olivia Wilde is the yes. female role. And they did not show her naked. Anyone that knows Olivia Wilde, yeah, you could understand our disappointment. We they showed her coming out of the water, but yeah, they strategically made that not so seeable in a white little dress, mad. but whatever. I was, yeah. I was pretty mad about that because everybody wanted to see that, <laughs> but no. And then it seems like they put a lot of effort into the alien, so give them credit for that. Yeah, they did it well. They, I like it. I said, it's not too much bashing because I thought it was a decent movie. Yeah, yeah. Uh, few of the inconsistencies is, uh, well, first off, I want to make comment that their station kind of looked like uh, Doofenshmirtz Evil yeah. Incorporated yeah. off of Phineas and Ferb, which was awesome. Yes, yes. <laughs> I don't know if that was purpose or kind of accidental, but that was pretty cool. It, it did look a little bit like that. I, <laughs> Except for the one right side balcony, it was like yeah. mirror. <laughs> but still good. Mm -hmm. uh, aliens kind of had like a feel from the movie, the aliens with the... Their the, chest the would open. Chest would open and little arms would come out like this. It's kind of, of a mouth. Yeah, like kind of reminiscent of the aliens off of Aliens. Yeah. With the little mouth popping out. <laughs> Family guy. <laughs> 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 uh, what else? Like like we said, the, you can't do really much bashing on this because it was a good movie. And that, it, was pretty, it was pretty good. Yeah. I mean, anyone that knows, aliens have been sighted throughout history for decades yeah. upon decades. And if you ever watch the History Channel, Ancient uh, Aliens, yeah, you'll... Yeah, you It took me a second. Uh, Brain you'll... Fart. You'll... If you believe any of that stuff, which I believe in aliens a little bit, so... It, there's been documents from cavemen, so... So, I mean, the logic is there. I was kind of laughing at people when they first when it first came out in the mm. theaters. I was like, "Dude, really? You're gonna go watch Cowboys and Aliens?" But now I kind of get why people actually loved it, and it got a lot of money. <laughs> it wasn't horrible. It wasn't. I mean, like it, like like we said in the Godzilla one, it could be like that. I mean, the aliens could have been like little raptors. They could have done that, but they didn't. <laughs> they thought outside the box on this one. Right, yeah. Uh, people who may like it. I liked it. Your average person would, I think. Uh, anyone who believes in semi-sci-fi or who believes in... This guy. I want to say the Western genre because... See, Mario. <laughs> the Western genre, people who love Westerns might kind of go against some of the things but it started off as a good western movie then the alien thing popped in side note the town kind of looked like red dead redemption yes, which was awesome yes. there was like mil there was like a handful of references of yeah. other things if you like pieced it together that way or that just might be my brain <laughs> but red dead reference in there along with Phineas and Burb, I th I caught, but uh, did the history, the people, Ray, who would you describe it to? Um, well, I would uh, anybody really. Like if you, if you're bored or if you just feel like watching it, it's a good movie. It really is. It's I don't got the cover. It's in yeah. the other room. It's it. That yeah, way it's that way. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> so, uh, but it's like like he said, it's anybody that kind of likes 
semi sci-fi and sci-fi and some movie a little bit out of the thing, out of the box. Good movie to watch. I'd recommend it to your average person. It was pretty good. And for those of you who may not know, yes, I do not have a life. I wear Mario shirts like every day. He at least has somewhat of a life. He goes to work. <laughs> I gotta go to school and it's boring. I'd rather watch Cowboy. I'd rather, I'd rather watch Godzilla, the American version, okay? <laughs> or Yu Gi Oh! That's pretty bad. Yeah. <laughs> and we'll end on that note. Yes, yes, we will. There's this.